Both panels have the same directory. In the left panel, let's enter the directory named destination. I tab into the right panel and enter the directory named data files. We will be copying files from the data files directory in the right panel to the destination directory in the left panel. First, let's see which files we have in the right panel. We have two directories called other data and other data2 and three files. Let's enter the other data directory. In it, we have two files, data file and data file2. Let's press backspace to go up and then enter the other data2 directory where we have the files data file 3 and data file 4. I press backspace to go up to the data files directory. The right panel is the panel in focus according to the marked line. The marked line is on other data 2 directory. So if we invoke an operation, it will be performed on this item. I press F5 to invoke the copy operation, then press enter to approve. The other data 2 directory was copied to the left panel, that is, to this directory. Like many operations, the copy operation is invoked from the panel in focus, or the source panel, and puts the result in the other panel, also known as the destination panel. Here the panel in focus was the right one, and the result was sent to the left one, but it can be the other way around of course. I tab into the left panel and go into the copied directory to verify it contains the correct files. I'll backspace up. I'll press delete to delete the directory and everything inside it. I press OK to approve. And the directory is gone. I'll tab into the right panel again and will now copy everything to the left side. I'll go to the first item and then hold shift and repeatedly press the down arrow until I select all the items. Selecting an item can also be done by pressing the insert key. If I press F5 I can copy everything to the left panel, but I want to show you another way. I hold shift and press the up arrow to go over the same items again, and by this cancel their selections. Now I press Ctrl A and by this quickly select everything. Then I press F5 and enter and everything is copied to the left panel. I'll go to the left panel and again verify that the copied directories contain the expected files. While in the left panel I press Ctrl A to select everything and then press delete to delete everything. I'll tab into the right panel. I'll select everything. To clear all the selection we can go to the mark menu and click on unselect all. Now I'll copy only three items. I'll press shift and down arrow on the first directory and on the last two files. Then I press F5 and enter and the three items were copied to the left panel. I'll go to the left panel and delete everything by selecting all the items and pressing delete and enter. I'll tab to the right panel. Now I want to copy one of the files from other data directory and one of the files from the other data 2 directory to the left panel. The naive way is to enter this directory and copy this file. Then backspace up and go to the second directory and copy this file. Quick as it was, there is yet a quicker and more clever way. While in the right panel I go to the command menu, there we have the flat view command. You can see that it can be invoked by Control B. I recommend using the hotkeys, so I'll cancel the menu and press Control B. Pay close attention to the file list. Can you tell what happened? We see all the files from all the directories as a flat list. How cool is this? When I walk over the files, the status bar shows to which directory each file belongs. Now it's easy to select the files I want and copy them to the left panel. I press Ctrl B again to return to the original view. This flat view feature can be used in different scenarios as we will see in this series. Finally, let's see the move operation. Moving files means copying them to the destination directory but removing them from the source directory. I'll go to the right panel and select two files. I press F6 to invoke the move operation and then press enter to start the operation. You can see that the files now appear on the left panel and no longer appear on the right panel, meaning they have been removed from this directory. 
Now let's move them back from left to right. I'll tab into the left panel. Press Ctrl A to select both of them. Press F6 and enter. See how quickly we have done it. Subscribe to the channel to not miss the upcoming chapters.